Dr. Terry. This is our latest rescue from the shelter. They just picked him up off the street. We don't know how long he's been there. He is super, super scared and nervous. And he looks really old, but I have a feeling he's not really as old as he looks. Um, look at over here, zoom in on his nose. This is all flea dirt. I mean, he has just thousands and thousands of fleas all over his body, which is why he probably has this hair loss. Um, and then if you look at his gums, I know, they're pretty pale. And I think they're pretty pale because these fleas are literally sucking all the blood out of his body. So what we're going to do is we're going to first give him a bath. Um, and then we're going to give him some medication to get rid of the fleas. Okay, buddy. And we are going to give him a good meal and just kind of see where we need to go from there. I think he definitely has got something going on with his eyes here. It may just be that there's hair poking him in his eyes. And then um, we're going to check him for worms because I almost guarantee you he's probably got a ton of worms inside that are also, um, you know, <laughs> drinking blood and making him even more anemic. So we'll bathe them right now and we'll see how good we can clean them up. Oh, look at it all Buddy, wanna come see me? Just checking on this guy today. It's been two days. We still need to get him all trimmed up, but he doesn't have a million fleas anymore. It seems like he's kind of starting to trust us a little bit. Are you trying to trust us a little bit? It's okay. He's actually coming towards me instead of just running away now, which is good. Go go outside? Go outside? Is that a tail waggle? Barely. Let's see if you can get a tail waggle. Hello, princess. Hello. Yeah. Oh, you're so sweet. I think he kind of likes it. You like that? Yeah, he does. You like it? I mean, he wouldn't even like to be touched when we first did this. Here's our Benji Boo getting his haircut, his real deal haircut. We're almost done, but he's going to a real home, and his new owner is super excited to pick him up. He looks so fancy. He's looking at me like, ugh. Oh. This is the last thing that we're gonna do with Benji. We're gonna clean up his teeth, which is called a dental cleaning, because he's got really bad tartar. His teeth just have some pretty nasty tartar all over them, so we're just gonna scale them pretty quickly, see if there's any teeth that need to be removed, and then wake them back up. So we found this tooth here that's probably causing him a lot of pain. This is basically the root of the tooth right here that you can see, so it's abscessed in there. We are going to go ahead and remove this tooth. So if teeth stuff bothers you, you may kind of want to look away, but we're drilling that in half with the root, and we're going to go ahead and extract that tooth so that he doesn't have any chronic pain in his mouth. Um, we want his new life to be pain-free and stress-free. So we're going to go ahead and remove that, um, and then hopefully he'll feel a lot better. There's this little spot where the tooth, the gums are sutured up where we took that tooth out. Check out little Benji's ears. So they're super infected and they have all this hair growing in there. So we waited till he was asleep and we're going to go ahead and pluck all this hair out um, so we can get to the source of the problem and get him some medication for his ears. Poor thing. This is why he was so sensitive about us touching his ears when he was awake because they're really inflamed and infected. All the hair is plucked out um, and we're going to go ahead and treat his ears um, for that infection and this has a steroid in it too so it's going to make him feel so much better. Hopefully no extractions on this side. Here's the before picture of how much tartar and plaque he has on his teeth, but we'll get those cleaned up too. Today is the day uh, Mr. Benji Man is going home to his new home. I don't know if that's really going to be his name, but he's done so great with us here, and we're so excited that he gets a second chance at life. And just want to say thank you to everyone at Vet Ranch for basically sponsoring him and paying for all of his care. Um, he basically had a complete body makeover and definitely a 
mental makeover too. So he's not defeated anymore and he's starting to trust people and really like us. So we are so excited to see him going to a forever home that is going to cherish him like no one ever did before. So thank you guys so much. Bye. You say thank you? Oh, you're boy. You ready? Are you ready? Oh, mommy. What are you doing? Look at you. Look at you. Oh my gosh. You don't look like a same doggy at all, do you? Uh-uh. Oh, he's beautiful. <laughs> I can't believe how good you look. Are you ready, Here, buddy? I actually, I brought a little collar and leash. Yay. Look at you. You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? <laughs> oh, stinking cute. All right, buddy. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Benji. Thank you so we'll much. We'll see you later. Thank you for donating his care. And it's our vet ranchers. Think. They donated that's everything. That's excellent. He just jumped right in, huh? He's like, all right, let's go.